minutes of wait. Fans finally got to see a little baseball tonight. And for the fifth straight year, the party gets bigger and bigger for the Reds fans on opening night. Local toes Brad Underwood is live at Great American Ballpark, taking in the late one. Many fans left, Brad? Well, hey, Brad, you know, it is a little late. We are starting to see uh, people leave the ballpark here as uh, the game's still tied. But, you know, when you talk about the Reds and baseball history, a lot of firsts come up. The Reds, the first professional team. Also, uh, the Cincinnati Red Stockings team, the only, the first and only to go undefeated, a 65 0 season. That team also the first team to play on both coasts in one season. But back in 1935, the Reds uh, held the first ever Major League night game at Crosley Field. As the rain hits the concrete inside Great American Ballpark, fans stare at a covered infield as they wait for the Reds to play ball. Inside the Reds Hall of Fame Museum, the Kings of the Queen City exhibit highlights the best from 1869 to present day. It's great to have these tangible pieces because night baseball is something that most people now take for granted. It's hard to kind of get your mind around the idea of it being something new and something different, uh, which it certainly was in 1935. May 24th, 1935, the Reds hosted the first ever Major League night game. They beat the Phillies 2-1. to one. On display, tickets from the game that, after taxes, cost only $1.75. Both teams also signed baseballs after competing in a game first of its kind. According to the museum, 20,000 fans attended the first night game in Cincinnati. And they realized, hey, a lot of people can't come to the game during the day. They can come at night, though, so why don't we give it a shot? And it worked tremendously well. For the second year in a row on opening night, the Reds players and coaches hit the red carpet, signing autographs for the fans as the club continues to maximize opening week. I love the tradition that they started doing the last couple of years, the opening night. Uh, I remember years where the first game was packed, you come the second night, and nobody was here. Love it now. There's so much going on, good crowd, so many festivities going on. Uh, big game against the Cardinals, looking for a nice bounce back. And now a fun little fact about that first night game uh, in the major leagues back in 1935. It was played on the 24th, but it was supposed to be played on the 23rd, but because of rain, it was pushed back to the next day. And Robin Cam, we had a little rain tonight, but they're getting the game in here at Great American Ballpark. Reporting live tonight at GABP, Brad Underwood, Local 12 News. Brad, thanks very much. Mr. Castellini is doing as promised. Mm -hmm. We appreciate the story. Well,